So y'all know it's about to go down once again, you guys. We have my addiction. I know this is bad to say about food, but this is literally my addiction, especially on keto. If I don't know, if I, if I don't know I'm on keto. I got my favorite wings, which is which they're the brand new ones which is crunch time is my favorite one. If you guys haven't seen me trying the, the, the flavors for the first time, head over to Steven Sushi 2. I tried the flavors for the first time, but today we're just gonna chill. We have a lot to talk about. Today we're talking about a lot, you guys. Today we're talking about B-Love's life and her weight. And we're talking about Quan Tran and we're talking about the stranger that I almost picked up. So if y'all wanna know about all that guys, this craziness, it's about to go down. So let's dig in because I'm hungry. Oh my gosh. Look at this, y'all. Steven Sushi ain't playing today. Yeah, look at this. Mmm. All right, guys. Let's dig right in. I'm hungry. I'm like, sorry. guys, I haven't ate all day. I've been fasting all day. It's now 6.30 p.m. So y'all know that it, it's about to go down. It's about to go like super ham right now. But thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for coming back and tuning in. If you guys like to set a better, I'm in my kitchen. If you guys like to set a better, let me know down in the comments below. I'll do more videos in my kitchen. We're, we're drinking today. We're drinking Mountain Spring, Mountain Valley water, which is the best water. It's in glass. And I love to take these glasses. We actually get this water delivered in five gallon containers if you didn't know that they have them in five gallon containers to my house and we hook we and we hook it up to our dispenser and it's the best water and the best soda you guys if you guys haven't had this one yet this is the zero sugar dr pepper strawberries and cream what are you guys doing with your life i promise you guys it's the best soda ever oh my gosh that with a little bit of heavy cream Makes a perfect dessert, you guys. I'm, I'm not even lying, but we got a side of Atomic. The guy was like, are you sure you want a side of Atomic? I'm like, yeah, I don't want to try it to but dip it in. He's like, okay, you might want to have some water next to you. I'm like, okay, thanks for the heads up. So he said this is super spicy. I've never had that Atomic ever in my entire life. So I want to try it. But yeah, you guys, we got Parmesan garlic and we have Crunch Time, which is one of the new flavors. It's temporary, I believe, but hopefully it stays forever. If you don't know what it is, it's hot honey and lemon pepper mixed together as one, and it's delicious. So if you guys want to try it, tell them that Steven Sushi sent you because Wingstop is actually sponsoring this video. Thank you so much to Wingstop. I'm just kidding. No. <laughs> Imagine. Yo, Wingstop, come here 50 thou. Come here 50 thou. Mm, guys, this is part of my Oh, let's pray. Thank you, Lord, Heaven, the Father, for blessing us, the Lord, bless us, Lord, in Jesus' name, amen. As in, and that's my ice maker. Mm. Mm, you guys, so you know I'm on keto, right? It's been so easy. It's been so easy. I don't know how. But, you know what, hold on. Hold on, I'm missing something. I, I know what I want on the side. Hold on. I've been craving a fat salad. Hold on. Some of this ranch. My salad. Sorry, but I've, I've, I've just been craving a, a salad with wings. I forgot about it. Oh, crap, hold on. I've been craving a, a salad with wings, and I just forgot about it. Oh my god. You know what? I'm gonna have to wake make my wings up branch from home. And just have it like in a big jar.
What? What did I eat today? I haven't ate all day. I can't believe it. Anyways. Everyone's talking about B-Love's life right now and her weight. It's just like, it, it just makes me so sad that people are coming for her. We're making up all these assumptions about her. Like stuff like they don't even know what's going on in her life. Like, everybody's just, like, talking about her. I go on TikTok, and there's people who have, like, like tea accounts or whatever, tea channels, accounts, I don't know what, what, what they're called. And they're like, beloved life went from this to this. Why? First off, she said that it's menopause, so we leave her alone. Second off, they don't know what she goes through in her personal life. I'm sure she knows what she's doing. I'm sure she's talking to her doctor. And I'm so, you know, like it, it just makes me upset that people are like jumping to all these conclusions when you see what a uh, what a 45 minute video and now you know everything about her life like No. Speaking about Bilo's life, this is our fourth bottle from her. Yo, this is our fourth bottle. This is a hectic one, and it just tastes amazing on Wingstop. I abuse it like in every Wingstop video. It's so spicy though. Um, yeah, but y'all don't know what people go through, guys. You know, so the world is such a bad place already. I don't know. It just doesn't make sense to me because I get like hate too off of like a 10 minute video that I decide to post and people like all of a sudden know everything about my life. It's crazy. <clears throat> this is so fire. Excuse me, but this is amazing. And shout out to my boy Quan Tran <laughs> and his wife. Quan Tran did the, my viral chicharron and guac challenge, and he made it, guys. Go check it out. I loved it. He's always good vibes, y'all. Love me some Quan. Okay, I don't know if I'm going to try this. this is, you know what? Let's... Somebody say, Stephen, why are you being a B-I-T-C-H? All right, let, let's just try it. Oh, hold on. Oh, yeah. That flavor. I don't like it. Is it the chicken? Yeah. 
I don't like that flavor. Mm. I'll stick to my beloved sauce. Yeah, I'm devouring these crunch times. They're so dang good. Yeah, so I've been working out. Yeah, so I've also been hitting the weights too, every day. I mean, well, today I didn't go. So I think I'm gonna have to go, um, probably to, probably tonight. But I was saying that I'm gonna have to hit the sauna like the next three days because although I'm on keto, like my water's not, my body's not holding much water. My baby shower is this weekend, and I have to make sure that, like, I'm, like, all the water's gone. And I, I know that's not a good thing, but I want to make sure that I'm not bloated. Because last year, the baby shower, bad. I was bloated as hell and swollen and... This year, Steven meant to look fine. At least try to, you know. <laughs> but. What? They ate a wing? Shame on your wings. Stop eating my wings like that. Come on, y'all. Why would you stop be doing that? Yo, crunch time at Wingstop. Please keep this flavor forever. Oh my gosh. Mmm. <gasps> we can stop up in the house. Mmm. Oh, and a little bit of this beloved sauce right here. Beloved, sponsor me. Oh my gosh, look at this. Mm. 10 out of 10. Oh yeah. I just gave you guys a little behind the scenes of a wing set of a TikTok. We stop extra ranch. Like dip that baby good. Oh! <laughs> yeah, I just give y'all behind the scenes of one of my TikToks. So if y'all see it. Go comment. I seen go go comment on the TikTok. I seen the behind the scenes or something like that. Okay, I do want to see something though. <sighs> okay, let me finish these. Oh, let me tell you guys what happened at Wingstop. So, we 
this is now a follow up because. Okay. Do you remember how I told you guys? Oh, that's only if you watch the salad bar live at Sizzler. That was like a few days ago. If you watch the whole thing, then you know what I was talking about. But if you, but it, but if, but if you missed it, let me tell you guys. Oh crap! I was at Wingstop. This was maybe like two weeks ago, and I was waiting for my order. The order wasn't done yet. I see this Mexican lady sitting down, staring at me. She was looking at me weird, like she was looking at me up and down, and I thought maybe something else, but it was weird. Because the way she was looking at me, like, weird, right? So I, I kind of felt like, why did she keep looking, like, does she recognize me maybe, or whatever, you know? So she says something to me in Spanish, and I can't really understand much Spanish, but I understand it enough that she needed a ride to a high school down the street. For whatever reason, she needed a ride because her ride wasn't going to be here for another hour. So, I'm such a fic- like, like I just, I don't want to sound like like cocky or anything, but like I have such a damn good heart, and I don't like to see people like because I I think about like well, what if my grandma she needed like a ride, but then again I wouldn't want her getting a ride from a stranger, you know? So I just thought about like a whole bunch of stuff. So I told her yes. So. I said, yes, like, let me wait till I get my, my food. So as I stepped away again, I was waiting for, for my food. Like, I was just thinking about, like, tons of things. I'm like, just, like should, should I give this stranger a ride? Like, no, like, this is not normal. Like, this is not okay. Like, yeah, she might be like, innocent. She might really need a ride. But, like, what if? Like, what if? Like, there's always what ifs, you know? What if she has a gun? What if she wants to kill me? What if she wants to rob me? What if she's going to go to, like, a... D-R-U-G house and gone like gone wrong I'm kind of on the crossfire like I, there's just tons of like things that are going through my mind what if she has an illness it spreads to my car like I have my son in my car my, my, my wife in my car like no so I, I told her I was like you know what I can't take you but I'll call you an Uber Uber I was an Uber uh, do you know what Uber is she says CCC. So I got her. So I so I got her an Uber to pick her up and, and and take her. But like, I felt good knowing that I helped somebody. You know, in need. I didn't wait, but. It said that she got I picked up because I got the alert on on my phone. But I don't know. What would y'all have done? I read you guys' comments on the last video and you guys said, Good job, Stephen, for not uh, picking up a stranger because you don't know, you know. So y'all made so y'all made me feel very comfortable with my decision. So yeah. Yeah, because I don't know, you know, like, it's almost like pick, picking up a hitchhiker, except she wasn't on the side of the road. She was in a wing stop waiting for her ride. All I know is that God will bless me, whatever it is, I did something good, you know. So, I told y'all, I'm no longer ever addressing trolls, because I heard a lot of people, a lot of you guys say that, Stephen, I love to watch you, but sometimes I can't watch you because, like, the, when you talk about the trolls, it just kills the vibe, and I don't want that to happen, you guys. I really appreciate you guys, and I know you guys want to watch me for good, like, positive vibes, 
So I've just been blocking. I've been getting trolls and I've just been blocking. They will never comment again. So how it works when you block a troll is they can comment and stuff, but it will never be shown to public or it'll never be shown ever. They can see that they posted a comment, but it, it will ne like only they can see it. So they, they there, there's trolls who have been commenting for years still that are still blocked. But I know that they're still commenting on my videos. I can never see them. But because when I sh like when I shout out my new channel, um, I haven't because it's a new channel like Steven Asushi too. Like there were trolls on there that I blocked like four years ago. That comment, they're like, oh, you have another channel, like, and then they'll comment like bad stuff. So I'm like, oh, block, <laughs> like you're not gonna infiltrate this channel. So yeah, I love that feature. <laughs> My favorite wings are gone. So I feel like they triple fried these, like these were sitting there because the taste of the bone is coming through the, uh, the meat. Yeah, that salad was amazing. We've been eating tons of like salads because they're, they're protein, they're volume. I mean, I'm not, not protein, they're just voluminous, you know? They're low in calorie and voluminous. But the the dressing that we use is Bolt House. It's lower calorie and it's um and it's and it's and it's keto. I'm gonna pick up some more of that. But you guys, this was delicious. I was just checking in with y'all. Um, and yeah, I hope y'all like watching this video. If you guys haven't tried the Wingstop flavors, because you think they're like, are they worth it? Crunch time is my favorite. It's like my third or fourth time getting it now because it's just so good. I hope they keep it permanently. I wish I would have got all of them crunch time because I would have tore them all up. But like I said, this is like, I don't know. They they, they, they did something funky to these ones. <clears throat> I mean, they're not bad. Yeah. If you have to take anything positive from this video, be kind to one another. Life is short, really short. My thing is, is like we're like we're not promised tomorrow. I have it's so sad, but I have I I have had. So many followers along the way who have passed, and it's really, really sad. One who I'll remember, his name was Lucas. It's really, really sad. He has he had skin cancer, and I think about him from time to time. It's really, really sad. So I, I don't want to. I don't know. I don't, I don't know why I'm getting emotional, but it's just like. You know, like life is so short. There's we, we don't have much time here on this earth. And for me, going into my thirties now, you guys know that I just had a thirtieth birthday. It's like, I like all I can remember is like only a few. I mean, if I can look back on years of my life, but I can only remember like the past fifteen years of my life. Everything before that, like, I, it, they're just bits and pieces. But yeah, so thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, I want to leave it here with positive vibes, you guys. Do something nice this week. Um, I have a collab coming up with someone very special. And, yeah, guys, do something nice this week. I don't know. I've just been trying to challenge myself to do, like, a good deed at, at least every week. You know, like, obviously try it every day, but, like, do something. Like, go out of your way and do something nice for someone. I don't know. I think it just, it just makes you feel good, you know, knowing that you did a good deed. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video, all right? Oh, and also, I have the What I Eat in a Day on Steven Sushi 2 going to go up very soon. So, comment. Uh, so, hit that subscribe button down below because I have a video of What I Eat in a Day on Keto on Steven Sushi 2 going up. So, stay tuned. I love you guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video, right? Peace.